Hi, this is Patty Regosa, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a class to MyLexia. So, you've heard that you've got to use MyLexia with your students. It's an excellent program for students who struggle with the basics of reading, but now you've got to get your students set up. So, what do you do first? You go to MyLexia.com. You, um, if you're not already set up with a username and password, just give me a call at 210-440-4913. I will see if I can get you set up in the program and give you access to mylexia.com or I'll get in touch with your administrator that's assigned to this program and then we'll have them add you to the program. But once you receive your email, your, your username and password, go to mylexia.com, you enter your email, use your password, log into the program and this is what you'll see. And as a as class access, you're actually going to be, you're going to see less of these, these tabs at the top. You'll have the student tab, the class tab, and the reports and teacher resource tab. But the main thing to add your students, you go to classes, and this is my demo that I use for my, for my trainings, but all you do is click on add a class, and you make sure that your school appears in this top uh, box, then you select the grade for the class that you're going to be setting up and then you name your class. You can do 8.30 or 9 o'clock um, Trevino or you can just do Trevino class or whatever. Whatever you want to identify the reports on later when you go back and look at the reports for these students uh, for this classroom. You want to make sure that you um, that your name appears in the that your name appears in the class, um, the class staff in the, this class box. And then we need to also add the students to this class. So if you don't see your name here um, on this side here, then go and find your name here. And all you have to do is click on your name and push add. And then at the bottom, if you don't, you probably won't see your students um, on this list. You probably won't see your students in this list because maybe they haven't been added yet. Um, so what you want to do is go to this button here, add new students here, and you want to make sure that you fill in their first name, their last name, a username and password, and um, Lexia does require that you have four or more characters as a username and four or more characters as a password. I highly recommend using a student ID for both. That way it's never duplicated um, later in the future. And then you want to make sure that you put their grade level and then select the school if your school doesn't already appear there. And don't forget to save at the bottom. Uh, save and done or if you want to add more students you need to add a whole class you can push save and add more students and then once you've done that all of your students will appear in this list here and so don't forget to save the class and once you've saved the class you're pretty much done the students ready to get into the program and I'm going to point out one more thing um, that you can actually print up let me see here print up login cards once you've set up your class. I was going to look at the class, but it doesn't look like it's coming up. Once you've set up your class, you can go and print up login cards for your students, and if they can't remember their student ID number um, as their username and password. So please call me if you have any further questions at 210-440-4913, or you can email me at patty with a y at swaslp.com. Thank you.